Hey, this is a nice bar. Hey, hey, I wanna cover half. Hello everyone, this is Pepper for Video. Welcome back for more Let's Play The Legends of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last episode, we discovered who is the real, real villain in this game. And in this episode, we're gonna go see what else we can do for Hyrule. So, as you can see, uh, Shay is the only one that's not here, so we're gonna come over here, check the map. And that is that, and Shay is at Snow Peak Mountain. Uh, so we're gonna go over there at Snow Peak, but before, let's talk to Shay. Uh, this guy. At the moment, I'm absolutely interested by this guy being known as the Uka. Yes, according to the legends, Hyrule has, was made by the Hylians, who, as we all know, are the closest race to the gods. But also, according to legend, long ago there was a race that even closer to the gods, and some say these creatures made the Hylians. Hylians, I mean. When they created the people of Hylia, they simultaneously created a new capital, a city that, a city that flowed in the heavens. They dwelt there, and some scholars believe that this race lives there still, somewhere in the great sky. Sky beings, isn't that simply marvelous, old boy? What I wouldn't give to meet them. Uh, this guy that doesn't talk much. Nothing. And Auru. Or Rauru. Say, Link, you're alive and well. Tell me, did you find anything of interest at the Advertise Grounds in the desert? The sages. Those sages actually served the royal family. Actually, they were appointed as tutors to the young Princess Zelda. It was from then that I first heard the tales of their cursed mirror in the Arbiter's Grounds. Oh, so that's the backstory to that. Hello, Telma. Hello, Louise. But um, before going to actually, uh, before actually going to the um, uh, place Ashay went to, we're going to warp. We're going to warp to Kakarika Village because we still have stuff to do. So let me just warp over here. Oh, there's kind of a specific point where you can warp in here in Hyrule Castle Town. Um, how many puzzles? One, two, three. Okay, we still have 17 puzzles, so there's not, that's not enough to go to the funny. But um, if it was nighttime, there would be another pole over there that we could grab. But as if it's not, uh, we're going to transform into human. No, no, what? Just two steps away, and it's not that two steps will change anything. Jeez. Okay, so from here, we're going to go to Malamart. Thank you. And we're going to talk to this guy. Um, 549, yes. I'm just gonna pay the, the entire cost. 49, 9, 4. No, no, no. Oh, crap. 549. Collect enough funds to finance repairs to the bridge connecting West Castle Town to Hyrule Field, brother. Those corrupt oh. price gushing shops in Castle Time are officially unnoticed, and they will rue. We hope you will continue your financial support of our efforts to sell products in town at discounted prices, brother. So, as we can now go out... Um, now that we've repaired that bridge, well, we didn't repair it as, well, as much as you think we have. You can come over here and talk to this guy. You made a donation, did you not? I am far-sighted in all things, my brother. Tell me, do you know of my junk one in, junk in Castle Town? He has yet to come back, even though they say the West Gate Bridge is fixed. Perhaps you could look on, on, in on him for me, bro, my brother. Well, yes, we are returning to Castle Town, actually. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. This episode is going to be warping a lot. Yeah, it's going to be warping, because we have not yet uh, talked to that floor, and we cannot activate that site. Warp back to Hyrule Castle. Because um, we actually, I didn't actually explain anything about the south gate back in Hyrule Castle Town. Um, I'm just gonna go across the city as a whole because I like doing that. Let's just go. And also, there's there's a lot of bugs I have not collected over here. How do you feel this shit? Jeez, there's just so much I have not done. But maybe that's gonna be for a later video because, jeez. See, what would you say you're good at? I'm good at picking up stuff up, really. I'd rather be playing in a meadow, but my master doesn't understand. <laughs> and your master is a scary cat. Hello, soldiers. We, we all know you're not that brave. 
And hello, people. Don't be afraid of me. I'm just a wolf that's walking by. Um, certainly, people, uh, I mean, wolves are supposed to be able to smell fear, so if you people are scared of me, you sh would die at any moment. So let me just transform into a human right now. Okay, so, um, what that guy was actually referring to back in that place is that you can come over here and you're gonna see a giant, uh, 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 an adult Goron over here. It's just gonna be all like, uh, what do I do? Hey, you are a human, yes? The other Gorons told me about you, brother. Just take a look at these rocks. Amazing. Was there an answer or something? What are you doing here anyway, brother? Are you trying to pass through here? If I drank some hot spring water, I might give me strength to break through a big rockfall like this. Hey, brother, if you find some hot spring water, you should come see me again. So, he wants hot spring water. And we come over here, let me warp again. Oh, sorry, guys. This cutscene is... This cutscene side quest is kind of... Uh, over warping. So now that we know that that Goron wants some hot spring water, just gonna warp back to Kakariko because there is a magical spring over there, and we are going to transform into human again so that we can. We warped over here. Do you think a sudden appearance of a wolf would not be so surprising enough? I mean, jeez! I mean, come on! A wolf suddenly appears out of nowhere, out of thin air, there is a wolf, and people think it's a monster. But we cannot transform into human in the same place because it's gonna creep people out. Uh, yes, perhaps you could look under him for me, brother. You know what? I hate you! Come on, come on over here. Um, what we need to do is we uh, want this lantern oil. Yes, let me, no, 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 yes, let me use it, and what we want to do is, hello guy, uh, yes, 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 I'll climb by, climb on, brother, and what we're going to do is, hello, we're going to, ouch, we're going to roll into the wall, and then we're going to climb up, and up because there is going to be a spring over here what you have to do is talk to this guy you saved our chief brother since this town was also attacking for the townsfolk would need supplies at night his son opens up a shop for potions but we can actually come over here and get some hot spring water now let me um, come over here hide and right here I want to work uh, you can warp just whenever you want, just by uh, talking to Midna at the right place. You just have to hide. And as we are warping back to Hyrule Castle Town, I'm sorry, guys. I'm just gonna cut some of these parts out. So we're back here at Sir's Domain. Okay, and we're back here. Uh, apparently, Sora's are not afraid of us, so that's a good thing to know. We should exit now, and down over here, down over here, um, actually before going into the place with Ashe, uh, we are going to jump down, and we are going back into Soros River, because I have something to do, kind of. Um, remember that? thing cutscene thingy that we didn't do last time because we didn't have any rupees when I tried to well I think it's about time we did so let me just grab some rupees over here in the grass come on do a spin attack dude oh, no there's nothing okay there's one two and three I'm just gonna show one attempt and if I cannot do this, we're gonna go move on with the story and I'm just gonna grab this thing off screen sometime. So let me transform into a wolf right now. I mean, into a human. What the heck am I thinking? My mind is just screwed up today. Kind of. And my neck hurts so badly. Um, 
Hello, Isa. Uh, rental feed. Uh, rent me one. Okay, now hop in. You all set? Have a good ride. So, this mini game, you see that icon over there? What we are gonna be doing is we are going to be uh, shooting this. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, be careful, you should not crash because that will give you less points. Um, we are gonna be shooting these jars over here. Um, each green one will give you one point, each of the red ones will give you two. So, uh, you wanna be really, really painful and careful with what you do over here. Um, I almost always uh, point at the top of the jars. That almost always gives me the points. No, 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 don't crash. Uh, the hard thing, though, is to not lose points because it's kind of hard to maneuver with this thing. Especially in areas like this that the curve just goes and uh, drags you away. It's one, it's two, and we go to the left, right, left thing, and there. Uh, seven points. You need. You only need 15 to uh, to clear the game. But it's kind of hard to get 15 because if you crush three times, you're done for. There's only um, there's only 18 yards, I think, uh, which some uh, not all of them give you one point. Some will give you two. Uh, but that's kind of my point uh, because you lose one point for each time you crash, and this place is kind of tricky to not crash in. Like for example, over here, there's gonna be these things. And there's gonna be this part where the rapids just go really, really, really weird. That is the place where a lot of people crash. Well, I actually crash a lot in there. And I'm just surprised it didn't crash right now. I'm just doing it. I've got the passing. Oh my goodness. My goodness. Fuck. He. No. Okay, I just take the hit. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get screwed. I'm gonna get screwed. I'm gonna get screwed so badly. I took three hits, which means I should get everything from this point. Just concentrate on aiming. Oh god. Oh god. No. Oh my god, I can do this. Uh, do you need 15 or 20? I don't remember. Maybe it's 20 because 15 is just too easy. And I... What? No, 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 no. Sheesh. No, 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 no. Okay, I think I'm not gonna make it. No. Turn around, freak. Okay, there. 21. 22. 23. And 25. Regardless of the score that we need, we got 25, which is pretty decent. So let me just go down. Please. Okay then. Um, what am I gonna get, please? No, no, no. Just remember not to crash over here because you can still lose points over here if you crash. So that's that. And what we are going to be getting is... Thanks for your patronage. On this trip, Brown River, you scored 25 points destroying targets. Congratulations! As the first customer to, start, uh, to score at least 25 points, you received this prize. And we get a giant bomb bag. So we can hold as many, as, or, uh, as many bombs as ordinary bomb bags. So the exact number we can hold depends on the kind of bomb that we are holding. But... We got an enormous bomb bag, which means more bombs, bombs, bombs for us. Okay, now we are going back up. Cause is it daytime or is it uh, sunset? I don't know. Just don't know anymore. I just don't know anymore, man. Just let me warp back um, up on top of this uh, source domain. Because we are now going to Ashe. Don't worry, we're not going to in another dungeon just now. There's still more stuff to do. Oh yes, there is. 
so we're gonna climb down. Come on, thank you. And, 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 and. Uh, we're gonna transform into humans right over here. And we're gonna free fall. Let free fall. Come on, Link, swim. Come on, Link, swim. Come on, Link, swim, swim, swim. Okay, then. So, we're over here. Thank you very much. And, and if you remember correctly, this place was frozen. But now we will be able to go through this cave. Okay, now we are back here. Look at that. It looks like weird monster thing this is snow peak uh, let's talk to it whoa it's a monster it's kind of a yeti link how does it know my name oh pff, that was a hat <laughs> I, I kind of prefer the hat please pff, that was just mean what brings you to a dangerous place like this ever since Sora's the main got covered in ice this mountain's been much colder than usual yeah not only that, but I heard a really weird story from the source. Apparently, the beast that lives somewhere in this mountain has been seen frequently in Sora's domain. I was curious, so I came and waited, and as they'd said, a giant appeared! Yeah, it looked like this. And we got a chase sketch. Um, whoa, kind of weird that uh, it looks kind of the same as the memo, though. Said it to be, blah blah. Apparently this thing's been stealing red fish from the village. I want to investigate further, but I can't even see the path through this blizzard, yeah? I'm sure you're here because you're curious about the mountain, but you'd best not go without a plan. Okay, so I think uh, we should ask about the fish that uh, she told us to, but that's gonna be in the next episode. So if you liked this video, subscribe to my channel, comment, Rape? No, not rape. Rape? And I'll see you guys the next time when we actually start asking about this stuff. Uh, the red fish, the rig fish. So the beast has been showing itself because it's been catching rig fish. We didn't think it, that anyone with such controls was capable of catching this type of fish. Well, I'm sorry I mis I misinformed you. We're gonna be going looking for. Um, we're gonna go looking for Prince Rallis. So that's what we were going to do next time. See you guys then.